So a few months ago, I was at a wrap party. Like when you finish filming a project and everyone gets together to celebrate the fact that it's over and it's done and we're all unemployed again. To another existential crisis that we will never be hired again and will be realized as the frauds that we secretly believe we are. To, to another, another existential, existential crisis, crisis that, that will never be, be hired again and will be realized as the frauds, frauds that we secretly, secretly believe, believe we are. We are. Anyway, I was at this party, and you know how parties go, you know, you get into different conversations with people, some you know, some are strangers. Hi, I'm Mikey. Oh, hi, I'm Anna, uh, nice to meet you. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah. Sure, cool. <laughs> and five minutes into the conversation, he said, Oh, cool, my girlfriend and I have a puppy. Shut up. And I felt this immediate and huge sense of relief. And I realized that the entire time we were talking, I had been doing this balancing act of trying to be friendly, but not too friendly so I wasn't leading him on, but also not trying to be a bitch. And when he finally told me that he had a girlfriend, I was like, oh, I can just be myself now. What? Shut up, show me. Do a video? Oh! And I started thinking, you know, some guys probably don't even realize that we have to go through this. Like a couple weeks ago, this guy approached me in a parking lot Hey, hey, excuse me. Yes? Hey, I was wondering if you wanted to go get coffee. Oh, I'm in a relationship, but thank you. Yeah, no problem. That's probably how he remembers it, if he remembers it at all. But do you want to know how I remember it? Hey! Yeah, yes? Stay calm. Inhale lots of air in case you have to scream. Go for the eyes and balls. Don't forget to bite. The jaw is the strongest muscle you've got. Shit, where's my phone? Maybe I can have my fingers on 911. Let's get coffee. Oh, oh my god, thank god. Why did he run at me in an empty parking lot at night? Jesus, that was scary. Uh, I'm in a relationship, but uh, thank you. Oh my god, why isn't he saying it? Why is he just staring at me? Oh my god. Why are you just staring at me? Oh my god. Fine. No problem. Yep. You know, there's a study done a while ago that sums it up perfectly. Men are most afraid that women will laugh at them. Women are most afraid that men will kill them. So the next time you think that women are a little bit complicated, remember, we see the world through very different perspectives. And who knows? Maybe that guy actually thought- Hi, um, be brave, Mike. You can do this. You can do this. I was wondering, you, you can completely say no, it'll be totally fine. Um, she's just a girl. She's not that scary at all. Do you want to go get coffee sometime? No! I'm Anna Akana. Stay awesome, Gotham. This is Beagle. Oh my god, he's purring. Oh my god, I want to say thank you so much to my BFFs at Audible for sponsoring today's video. Oh my god, you guys, thank you! Audible has an unmatched selection of audiobooks, original audio shows, news, comedy, and so much more, you guys! Right now, I'm listening to The Name of the Wind. Because Game of Thrones has like a gaping hole right here in my heart and I need to fill it with some more fantasy. And my favorite, because I live in LA, is I get to like listen to Audible whenever I'm stuck in traffic or whenever I'm doing laundry or whenever my eyes are full but I really want to fill my ears. You can go to audible.com slash Anna because they're offering a free 30 day trial for you to try out their service. And you can download The Name of the Wind or just browse their like unmatched selection and download one of your choice. Don't forget, that's audible.com slash Anna. Oh my god, thank you!